Thanks for clicking on this video and watching this new episode of our review of the Bell Mead Special Reserve 108 point X proof. <laughs> uh, stick around with us and hear our thoughts. All right, welcome back. I'm actually excited to be doing this. This is, I, I think this is the bottle that is no longer in production. Um, I don't know really? if somebody, yeah, I don't know if somebody bought the company. <laughs> Do you want to turn off your phone, dude? and maybe get it off the the filming table <laughs> <laughs> bottles being discontinued our local package store actually had a decent amount of them i think they're down to like five now so i saw it and grabbed it a lot of people are grabbing this when they see it being replaced by nelson, 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 nelson brothers nelson, nelson, nelson brothers yeah. bourbon yep. nelson brothers company correct uh i guess they're gonna replace it with two different types classic and reserve uh so if you can find it I guess stick around and let's see if it's worth see buying. It's worth it, yeah. All right, who wants to go first on, on the nose? <clears throat> I'll go. All right, you go, Chaz. Off the bat, I get a very um, soury mash taste. It's it's sweet, but it has that mash taste of a, a, of a sour mash uh -huh. bourbon to me. Not very uh, alcoholy or stingy on the nose. I, it reminds me of something I've had in the past, but I, I, I can't put my finger on it. I don't taste oh it. I don't, I don't sense the charcoal <clears throat> oakiness so much, but I do kind of like a sour mash. It's, it's not bad. You're going to think I'm crazy. All right, well, let me go, and then we'll hear your craziness. Ahead. To, me, to me, this smells like a pecan pie. This is like a... Okay, yeah. If you just kind of open it up a little bit and then just get that initial air coming out. That's like a Thanksgiving pecan. That's why I'm getting the, the sour mash. <laughs> You're still going to think I'm nuts. I get a... Uh, Maybe not. Maybe not. I'm just getting a lot of pecan on this. Like very, very sweet notes. Uh, no, no, I don't get any fruit on this at all. None. It's, it's a... Whoa. Whew. Man, it's, it's got a little, little kick there too yeah. sometimes. You ready for me to blow your mind? Yeah, go ahead. Ready? I get a little bit of vanilla in this one. I think I finally... Two words. I think I finally smell some vanilla. Two words. Oatmeal cookie. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. We'll That's go with what that. I get. Okay. Straight up oatmeal cookie. Yeah. It's yeah, not an okay. unpleasant... Yeah, I, I think we're all similar. This is like a... This is like a thing... Like you walk in on Thanksgiving, you, you've just eaten, and you walk into like all the cakes and the pastries and the... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Baking aromas. Yeah, yeah. Oh, so, I still sure. get a, a, a sour mash like this was yeah, a yeah, distilled God. whiskey, you know, with different things. Is this just the corn, Chaz? Could be. Did you compromise yourself again? Just dumped it on my beard. <laughs> Dumbass. <laughs> it burns. Matt has put whiskey everywhere but in his mouth today. <laughs> All right. Let's taste it. And I, see. I, I do. I think I am getting a little bit of sour you're talking about. All right, here we go. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, to me, that is smooth, but it's got some almost cinnamon prickliness on the tongue. Okay, sweet. okay, okay, okay. It's sweet. It has no linger. I mean, it's gone right there, but it's still, it's tasty. Wow. Um, this is like drinking solid uh, brown sugar. Yes. Yeah, solid brown. Like if you were to just take um, brown sugar with some water and dil or not dilute it. Um, uh, dissolve it? No, not dissolve. When you when you make it thicker, what is it? I can't. Why reduce not? it? Reduce it and re get to like the reduction. Mm -hmm. That's good. Maybe a little bit of syrup. Like Syrupy? A, though, I mean, it's not like maple. You mean? No, not a maple. You always go for the maple. No, it's well, just, that's syrup to me. It's just. Uh, it's got a good viscosity. Good mouthfeel. <laughs> yeah. Mouth feel. yeah. There it is. It's got a good mouthfeel. To me, it oh prickles gosh, your tongue a little, wow. but it's very good. You're right. It's straight up bacon spices and brown sugar. That's yeah. what I get. That, this is like drinking. Very tasty. Like a pumpkin pie in your mouth. That, I get a that's little a clove little on the finish. Oh, okay. Maybe, maybe, maybe that's, that's what I'm burn. thinking. Clove. And um, you're right, Chaz. It's, oh not, it's not a long finish. It's not, not a long, long finish. finish. I like it though. It's good. I think I paid fifty nine bucks for this bottle, and I, I would I'm gonna go buy another bottle. 
it's that good. Uh, I, I, I like that. I really enjoy this. I this think I good. would probably drink this with a cube. Wow. This would be a good yeah. cube. Yeah. What, a long, yeah. take your time, drink. This would Spicy go, cigar? Spicy cigar. Or actually, if you had a, a, a little bit of a subdued cigar, maybe a Connecticut. Yeah. Uh, this would go great with that. It, it's not overpowering, but it just gives it a nice little touch. There's some other note in there, like a, a red, like a red licorice almost. All right, let me go in for a second sip. Go like ahead. if you if you get it through the retro hill, there's like a red licorice. Maybe note. it's that. That's what I'm saying. What I'm thinking is that peppery taste. Maybe a red pepper, to me on the. Now on the, I definitely the get the this spice. This and what's weird is this spice is not. It's not normally a spice for me yeah. is like up front. The spice is like comes way later for me. There's like a, a weird red, like the Twizzler. On, on like the very, 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 very end of this. I can't say I'm getting that. <clears throat> to me, I, um, I definitely, it tastes like a over 100 proof, which is kind of what, what I'm what starting proof to is enjoy. This? One, so one, one, 108.3. There you go. So put a little bit in your mouth. Don't swallow it. Keep it on your tongue. And breathe, breathe out through your nose with it on your tongue. Tell me you don't get a little Twizzler from that. Like, oh, like the red yeah. Twizzler? Let's see where you're going with that. Yeah. Yeah, little. Um, I think what people are calling that is medicinal cherry. Medicinal cherry. Yeah, interesting. Like, um, almost like a Luden's cough drop cherry, as opposed to like the fruit cherry. Okay. Wow. Uh, see, see, it's not that bitter for me. So this I'm is. Getting. Is it? Well, yeah. It, if well, if it kind of goes to like the bitter areas of your tongue, I can see that. But mm. if you drink it like a normal person, so I'm getting it's <laughs> asshole. It's still no, 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 no. Because it tastes like a Swizzler. I get a good mouth feel. It, it, it has a nice little prickly feel on my tongue. Yeah. For me, it's not overpowering, and uh, there's a sweetness to it that I really enjoy. Yeah, this is one of the few that I think I've had recently where I think the nose, I could understand the palate from the nose. I get that too. Yeah. This to me um, is almost what you'd expect if you've never had bourbon. And you say, there you I'm go. Give that's you a glass of bourbon. That's why I said the sour man. Very yeah. quintessential yeah. bourbon smell. Yeah, this is like that. Good point. Like if, if my granddad were alive still and he came in and slapped down a bottle of bourbon, that's what you would expect. Yeah. This is what you imagine that being. Yeah. Yeah, I can yeah. get that. I get yeah. that. Very good. I really enjoy this. So would you buy this bottle? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Would I you buy it? Oh, yeah, absolutely. So of the, well, well... Wait a minute, what's the price point on this? I, I think 60. I want to pay like 59 It's like 60 I was it just used, there and saw there's a couple left. Yeah, it used to be significantly cheaper, but now that it's on its way out, I will probably go buy another bottle of this. This makes me interested to try the, um, I guess, the regular Bellmead, because this is the reserve. Wow. Wow, I really it's enjoy good. this. I really enjoy this. Good. So, okay, if you were to compare this to something that you enjoy, would you put Eagle Rare above or below this? Okay, would you, so different. I don't know that Would I you put Sinatra above or below this? Ooh, okay, that's a good call. Um, so to me, Sinatra is more leather and tobacco, uh, less sweetness. I'd say that I'd rate the, the Sinatra above it, but not significantly above it. But they're definitely different. Oh yeah, that's pure tobacco. I know how I know how much you like the Sinatra. Here, hang on, hang on. Stuff right there. Have you had this, Chef? If, if you want to try a little bit, try try that. I wouldn't mix it with the Belmine. God, th this is just a, a solid bottle. It's it's really just disappointing that it's going away. Oh wow! Whatever replaces it. So you put it, the Sinatra above that. I do. Um, you got wow. a special place in your heart for that Sinatra. I do. I do. This now look. I agree with him. I tatered. And bought another bottle of this for way more yeah. than it was worth. But okay. I do like this bottle. Just a quick... This smells like you would think bourbon smells like. Yes. Yeah, 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 absolutely. This is definitely something that smells like it was designed. Tobacco and leather, baby. That's all I get from the Sinatra. Right now I'm getting... Man, that is, right now I'm getting more of the leather. It's a good this, bottle. Listen, let me... Okay, I'm just going to sum this up real quick while he tastes the Sinatra. This is a, in my opinion, a rock-solid bottle. Oh, if, you can, if you can find this... Get this bottle. I agree. No, really, really good bottle. You cannot go wrong with that bottle. Can you compare this to the four gate? No. It's another bottle you loved, and this is why I'm going here with you. Okay, you did the you Sinatra. Grab, the me, the that, four grab gate. me that four gate. I, I forced you to do the Sinatra. 
So, yeah, you're right. This four gate was like my all time You favorite almost bottle. had a whiskey gas yeah, on the four gate. I did. <laughs> I forced you to compare to Sinatra, so. God, I love that Sinatra. But the Bell Mead's super solid. Yeah. Did you like the Sinatra better than the Bell Mead? Uh, we, you know, two different. Different, right? Different, yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 This one would be a more bourbony taste, yeah. more traditional bourbon, right? Uh, this is, I would think. I hate to say it. It's not. I'm, I'm not trying to badmouth it. It's very good. This would probably go better with a cube. It's a little slightly yeah. diluted, it's more tobacco and for leather. Cube, yeah. This two is fingers, a, two cubes. A, a very yeah. sour mash, uh, traditional bourbon. Very yeah, good. The Bell Mead screams oh, bourbon. See, this is a JD, yeah. a JD uh, Rocks class. I didn't. Perfect. I should have given you that. Well, no, I'm doing oh, I'm four gauge. I'm good. No, I'm not. Oh, yeah, sour mash. So, Matt, how does it go down? There it is. <laughs> Bourbon gasm. The four, four gates better. Four gates better. But remember, that's a $200 oh bottle. God, that is so good. That's a $200 bottle. That's a $50 bottle. Is this is $150 this is, this better. Yes, it is. But, for, <laughs> <laughs> yes. Let's just clear that up. Yes. I can't believe how good this is. This is insane. For this being half the price. Less than half. Put, put that away. Um, here's well, the, here's the, but here's the problem though Both of these bottles are going away What? Yeah, this is a limited release Yeah, And this is being discontinued So we're kind of doing like the best discontinued brand here I, I, I'm glad that I have a second bottle of this Glad I got a second bottle of Sinatra I will be going to get another bottle of this Fair I mean, yeah, this is a, that's a great Look, bourbon Listen, great I mean bourbon. this is kind of, here, yeah, put this back This is kind of silly to be comparing it to these things But like I said before, if you can find this and you've been on the fence, like you know it's being discontinued, but you haven't had it, should I get it? Should I not get it? Should I pay a little more? Pay a little more. Go get it. Have it on your shelf. Experience it. You can't go wrong, in my opinion. Absolutely. Agreed. Quintessential yeah. bourbon flavor. Yeah. Very yep. good. Yeah. All right. Cheers, guys. Cheers. See you on Cheers. the next Thanks. episode. Last one. Wow, God, that fork is so minute, bro. fucking good. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are compromised? Might be feeling a little bit. Oh, might be, yeah. I mean, we're drinking a lot more than what you think we're drinking.